You know, you know, you know what I'm trying to say. It can be also closer. You need to speed this up. You just want to pick this keyframe. What's happening guys? My name is Alex and guys, thank you so much for freaking over freaking 24,500 subscribers. It's freaking amazing guys. I can't thank you guys enough for this and um, yeah guys, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to like make a time lapse in After Effects. So let's say you have a clip and um, let's say you are um, setting the camera down and you're doing something like cleaning your room, packing everything, breaking down your setup, setting up your actual PC, your setup in a time lapse. I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now. So I would say make sure to smash the like button down below on already and I would say let's start off with the first tutorial of today. All right guys, so right now we are in After Effects and as you guys can see, I took like a nice um, clip of a uh, beach uh, with like the sun going down. This is like a time lapse. I'll show you guys real quick. As you guys can see, very cool, very calm. And I'm going to speed this up and make this a time lapse. So what I'm going to do, it is really simple guys. Just follow these steps and it's gonna be amazing. Okay, so this is the normal tempo and let's start off with making this a time lapse. So the first thing that you wanna do guys is uh, make a pre-compose. Always make a pre-compose. So you wanna go to layer, pre-compose at the bottom, bam. You wanna check the top one, press okay. And then you're, um, when you do it correctly, you're, as, you can, as you can see your track, your video file will turn brown grayish. What we're gonna do now is it's not finished yet. We don't have it like a time lapse yet. It's just a normal speed. But what you wanna do to make, you know, to get the keyframes is, and we're gonna, you know, speed it up with the keyframe. Go to layer, you wanna click on time and press enable time remap. Click that one and as you can see, we have a little dot at the beginning and a little dot at the end. And those are called keyframes. And I think like, Alex, that sounds so freaking difficult, like complicated keyframes and doing everything is so freaking simple, guys. So to make, to speed this up, actually, you can see this is the beginning. You, do, you don't want to touch the keyframe in the beginning. You want to set your mouse on this keyframe and just drag it to the beginning. And that is going to speed things up. So let's see how the time lapse looks right now. That looks a lot better, guys. Look at this. That looks freaking amazing. It can be also closer. So what you want to do to speed the you need to speed this up. You just want to pick this keyframe and also you know the closer you drag it to the beginning, the faster the footage is going to be. So let's let's say I'm gonna put it right there. So let's see how it looks right now. And it's a little bit laggy, guys, because this is a really high quality file. This is like a like a H I think it's like a 4K thing, so that's why it why it's why it's um, like stuttering a little bit but as you guys can see it goes pretty fast you can do it even closer as you can see and it's gonna be a lot faster like you know it's gonna lag as you can see right there you know what I'm trying to say so if I put it right here it should be a little better though yeah guys this is actually a video of a 30 minutes so this is not only like a video like this in the real video the Sun is going down but 30 minutes guys that's gonna lag as hell this is a video of two minutes I cut that out of the 30 minutes two minutes and it's already lagging. and I don't have a shit PC guys I have an i7 processor 16 gigabytes of RAM the whole nine yards so it's just it's like a 4k file so that's basically how you make a time-lapse guys it's that freaking simple you can just like i said in the intro of this video um like you can set the camera down and you can just um pack something you can clean you can set up your computer you can take it down you can do anything you want so that's what something is guys that's how you make a time lapse and uh, it's so freaking simple i hope you guys enjoyed this video and um that's the end of the tutorial so that's easy that's guys that's how you make a time lapse video so i want to thank you guys for watching thank you guys so much for the continued support and i will see you guys actually um in two hours for the last after effects uh, tutorial of today thank you so much for watching and tomorrow guys i'll be uploading two obs tutorials that are like requested so if you want to know more about those updates like when i'm uploading and what and sneak peeks and everything so make sure to follow me on twitter and instagram everything is in the description down below so you won't miss out any new sneak peeks so thank you so much for watching guys thank you for liking and commenting on this video and i will see you guys actually in two hours like i said before so thanks again i will see you guys in two hours in about uh four episodes it's going to be the 22nd of may and then i find something else when i started using video editing software it was like i have my own patreon page you a fucking troll. Channelpages.com. Kind of nice weather. And I'm a tight with just Alex Alford. You know, it's his channel, so that's a bit of a logic.